Can I also get some change from you? Yes, like sir. just the regular yeah. uh, Gibraltar change to collect. Possible to get sort of ten pound in coins. I'm a coin collector from England, so. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Only just leaving the apartment this morning. Um, well, quite late actually. I, was, I set my alarm for six a.m. because I had plans to go up to the airport and take some dawn photos of the rock. I obviously um, hit the uh, off button instead of the snooze button on my phone. And I woke up at um, half 10. <laughs> it's just turned 12 o'clock at the moment, I say, only just leaving the apartment now. So, so I've wasted a lot of daylight, but never mind. Um, on the way out now, out in my little back street here. It's pretty cool. <laughs> it's got a lovely colonial feel to it, this place, obviously. But yes, okay, so today, um, I've got to do loads of little jobs, loads of little missions to make up for the time lost. I'm gonna head back down towards the cable car station, try and find an antique shop dealing in coins. I've been asking about coin shops, but can't find any anywhere and there's plenty of stamp shops and they're selling the basic coins or like the um, annual sets and things like that, but no one's selling any of the old Christmas uh, 50Ps and things like that. So that's what I'm looking for, some of those Christmas 50Ps. I've been told about a antique shop I can try. It's near the cable cut station, so I'll do that. And then after that, hopefully gonna be heading to uh, Europa Point, where the big lighthouse. We'll take some photos there. Actually set the tripod up, do some time lapse. All good stuff, so here we go. How much are the the twenty pound proof like Churchill? I've got twenty five pounds each. Twenty five pounds. Okay. And what about the little uh, maquettes in the little red red box, the monkeys? Which one do you mean? One of these in the red I box. I've got the silver proof. Oh okay. That's thirty pounds each. Thirty pounds. We have each. those for five pounds each. Have they got the monkey on the back? Um I don't no. think I have any with the monkey. No. But those are silver proof. Okay. I'll take one of those Churchill. One. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, not okay. Fantastic. Very good, sir. Yeah, very nice. It's an ounce of silver. All oh, right. Very good, sir. I'll, I'll wait for, because I want to ask you more questions. Sorry. Okay. Thank you. Okay, sir. Okay. Can I also get some change from you? Yes, like sir. just the regular yeah. uh, Gibraltar change to collect? Okay. Is it possible to get sort of ten pound in coins? Yeah, okay. So that's, that's your forty pounds. Yeah, and then that's another five, ten. 10 pounds, yeah. yeah, can I get that two pound coin? Yeah. Yeah. So what do you want Fifty p's would be good if you got enough. I'm a coin collector from England, so. <laughs> Three pounds, four pounds. You want twenty p's as well? Yes. Yeah. Please. Yeah. Yeah, we have five pounds. Okay, so that's seven. Seven. One pound. Eight. Eight. <laughs> I'll take a ten piece if you want as well. Okay. That's another pound. All right, that's One it. Pound more, no? Yeah, I'll have a pound coin. And any any one you do. Uh, fantastic. Yeah, Cheers. Oh thank you. Um was the the Churchill coin was it a quarter ounce silver you said? Or no, is that one ounce? Oh one ounce. Well oh, fantastic. Ounce, yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.
Hola. 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 Right, so I don't know how much of that you got, but <laughs> I've just been into this antiques shop and it's a bureau to change. I was asking about the Christmas coins and he didn't, he doesn't have any. And I asked if there's a coin shop or some specialist place. No, nothing, which is bizarre, I think. Anyway, um, I bought a proof set. I'm not sure what the age of the proof set was. I'll have to show you when I get back to the hotel, um, to the apartment. And I bought a one ounce Churchill uh, 20 pound coin, I think it was. It also let me change up 10 pounds worth of coins. So I've got a whole stack of 50 Ps, loads of monkeys for your bungle, uh, lots there to look at. So we're onwards to near the cable car. Um, I'm not sure if I want to dip into the botanical gardens and try and find one of those dragon trees. But yeah, I'm going to go to uh, Europa Point. I think it's probably my next stop. I am on the bus. I'm gonna cross into Spain and go down the coast a little bit and yet yeah, and do some other photos um, from a distance looking at the rock. Um, I think there's a little marina just down the coast. So I'm gonna get the marina and some rocks and things in the foreground. So hopefully that all works out, fingers crossed. It's my first time ever, ever to Spain. So I don't speak any Spanish. But all I've got to do is cross the border and walk down the road a little bit. So how much Spanish will I actually need to know? Probably not a lot. So <laughs> uh, I don't have any euros. I don't think I'll need any euros. Anyway, all right, I've got my passport. Yes, yes, I've got my passport. So wish me luck. And there you go, I'm in Spain. No hassle, no questions. Didn't even have to show my passport, just walked through. I'm walking down the coast a little bit, looking for somewhere to set my camera up. The weird thing is, 
the further I go away from the rock, the bigger it seems to look. <laughs> it doesn't seem to get any smaller. So, a bit of a weird one, but still looks absolutely huge on the horizon. It's quite a nice shot here, actually, into this marina here. 